the whole experience of going to the show is a little surreal. Beforehand, they prep you with, all right, if you win, you've got 50 seconds from the time they call your name until, it's, you know, that's it, the orchestra starts playing. So don't waste any time getting up there. And the Oscar goes to... John Knoll, Hal Hipple, Charles Gibson, and Alan Hall for the Pirates of Caribbean. When we did hear our names, try to get up on the stage as quickly as possible, and you know you want to make good use of that time. One thing that, that I was not prepped for is you get on the stage and there's all these uh, lights in your eyes and you can hardly see anything. One thing you can see very clearly, right in the center of your vision, is there's a big screen TV with giant numbers counting down. Because you know you're trying to remember to appropriately make use of that time, thank the people that they're so responsible that you're being up there, and then all of a sudden you see 17, 16, and. <laughs> First, gotta, gotta thank uh, Jerry Brockheimer for entrusting us with this great big project. For me, probably the most emotional part of it was that next Monday after the show, when we came back here, the whole company had, had gathered and the joy and the emotion on everyone's faces was actually a really emotional thing. To see just how happy everybody was because they were all a big part of making that happen. And so that was, that was the best part of it for me.